DIYers and welcome to my channel. I'm Crafty Lady Edda. Now today we're going to be doing a very special project. So if you like what I do, please comment below. I would love to hear your comments and see your comments. Now tap that notification bell and, notif and YouTube will notify you of any upcoming videos. And like and subscribe. So let's get started. You're going to need to draw the chicken parts. You're going to need different colors of felt. You're going to need different kinds of material, cotton if preferable. You're going to need beans, measuring tape, needle and thread. And you're going to need pens, a pen and scissors and a ruler. Let's get started. Hi DIYers, friends and family. Welcome to my channel, I'm Crafty Lady Edda. Now today I'm going to be showing you how to make some awesome bean bag chicken. It's going to be an awesome project. It's very simple to do. Now when you, I'm laying out the cloth, you need to measure the cloth 20 centimeters by 11 centimeters. Okay? Alright, let's continue. it's 20 exactly 20 centimeters this way and 11 centimeters this way okay, or you, you may have a hard time with your chicken okay okay now I've already cut and ironed these now this is one chicken this is the comb the beak and this is the waddle for this one and for this blue one I thought I'd do a blue waddle a blue comb blue uh, waddle and an orange beak okay so let's get started okay now you're going to get this you're going to put your waddle here to let it stick out a little bit okay same thing with the beak the beak has to stick out just a little bit so when you sew it you won't miss and the waddle the waddle is going to be here this way then you're going to pin everything together Now that I have these pinned, I have the beak here, the waddle, and the comb up here. So you're going to uh, sew it from here to here and then stop because you're going to use this to stuff it in. Okay. Okay. Now that I sewn this, well, let me cut off some of these. Now that I sew this and this, we're going to stuff it here. But I'm, let me put it inside out. We're going to make the eye, okay, right now. The eye is going to be right here. Okay, so here's the waddle, the beak, and the comb. Okay. Now, let me make the eye. And now, I just cut some round black circles for the eye. See it? Oops. <laughs> and now I'm going to sew it on the, on the chicken.
Okay, now that I've already sewn the eye on this side and on this side, which I thought is pretty cute. Okay. So I'm going to get this stick and kind of like poke out the, the ends a little bit. Okay. Now, I'm going to get some of this. It's fill. And again, I get it from the pencils. I mean, from the pillows, sorry. I put a little bit in the front. The rest is going to be the beans. I'm using pinto beans. Uh, now, I could use rice, but the only reason why I don't use rice, I recommend the beans, pinto beans, is because they have a harder shell. And I have experience with filling a uh, thing that I've made in the past with rice, and that did not turn out so well. Um, the rice ended up after about a year. It ended up, you know, kind of like seeping through the material. I really didn't like the way it came out. So, and then all we gotta do is just uh, sew the ends. We're going to sew the ends this way because it's going to be a rectangular shape, okay? All right. Okay, now I did the other bean bag. I'll show you the end results at the end of the video. I did the other one, this one. Got the comb up here the beak and the water. We're going to sew it from here to here. Okay? Okay, now that I finished the chicken, see the eyes, the beak and the water. Now I stuffed it with a little bit of stuffing. Now I'm going to fill the rest up with beans. So it will be a bean bag also. These are going to turn out super cute. Awesome, awesome. Remember, I would advise you to use beans instead of rice because the rice is just... Okay, now, this is my second bean bag. I'm only doing two right now. Okay, notice how it's like this, okay? Now, you're not going to sew it this way. You're going to sew it the opposite way. This way. So it'll have the shape of a pyramid. See, you're gonna sew it this way. So you can make a little square, triangle, pyramid. Okay, okay. here's a little finished product, the little bean bags. Aren't they cute? There's that one, and then there's this one. The eye to wobble the beak. I thought they came out really cute. They have beans on the bottom. Okay. Well, there you go. That's the finished product. They came out so cute. Okay, until next time, keep on crafting. Bye.